Hi, everyone. This is Dr. Palacios, and I'm here to review another question regarding migraine headaches and supplements. Today's question is going to be regarding vitamin B2 or riboflavin. I have been taking riboflavin for about two months, and I intend carrying on taking it for the time being. I have been having chronic pain since January, but the last month or so, I am at least feeling so much better. I will suggest riboflavin is worth a try and give it three months. So first, let's review what riboflavin is and what it does in the body and the cells. Now, riboflavin or vitamin B2 is one of the groups of the B vitamins that we as humans can't make. Therefore, we need to take it from diet or supplementation. Now, what it does exactly, it helps the mitochondria do its work better. Just like we talked about with magnesium, how it protects the mitochondria, riboflavin actually is one of the compounds to make the energy happen in the mitochondria, or that we call ATP, the form of energy. The nice thing about riboflavin is that in addition to doing the work of the mitochondria, it also protects us from lipid peroxidation, which is the fat breakdown. And riboflavin also protects us from high levels of homocysteine. And homocysteine is this compound metabolite that can lead to heart disease, specifically atherosclerosis. Obviously, there's many other ways to lower the levels, and riboflavin is one of those. Now, the foods that are high in riboflavin are the following. Eggs, meat, so all kinds of meats, so salmon, chicken, beef, organ meats, and so on, you name it. And lastly, almonds. Now that we understand a little bit of what riboflavin is and where we can find it, we can also now discuss what it does in the brain. Because after all, migraines is a condition that affects the nervous system and the neurological pathways. So riboflavin acts in the nervous system as an antioxidant protection and removes toxins in the brain. In clinical studies, Riboflavin has been shown to reduce the number of migraine attacks per month. And the nice thing about it, the only side effect you have to worry about is yellow urine. And if you think riboflavin could be a supplement that you'd like to try out for yourself, please remember to reach out to a professional or myself so we can go over your case and see which form of riboflavin could be used for you. And if you'd like to work together and address the root causes of your migraines, please click on my bio link below. And we can also find alternative ways to your migraines and other conditions as well. And it's all at the comfort of your home. Thank you so much and have a great rest of your day.